Hey YouTubers, Big Frank here out at the uh, bunker and today we're going to take a quick look at the uh, Sugar Sugahara uh, chainsaw bar. I got one today in 28 inch. It's their lightweight bar. So it has the inserts in it. Let's get a little closer here so you can get a better, better look at it, sort of. Uh, this one is for a Husqvarna large mount. And it's a 3 8 pitch, 50 gauge bar, 28 inch. So I run that bar on my 372 pretty much all the time. Uh, I have a 288, I run a 28 inch bar, and that's the reason why I got the 50 gauge and the 3 8 pitch, because I've got a ton of chains for them, and it uh, just works out good for me. I'm not a big production firewood guy. I, uh, I do firewood just as a side business, and uh, so I don't need any, any big heavy duty stuff. But I did like to try, I did want to try this bar, and uh, so we're going to take a look at it today. Uh, we're going to put it on this saw, which is a Husqvarna 372. Uh, I run Oregon power cut bar on it. It uh, works really well, but I thought I might have something a little bit lighter on the uh, on the front end to see if it, it helps a little bit uh, with bucking. So this saw pretty much is kind of hard to tell, but it's a little front heavy uh, with this bar on it. So we're going to check out weights, differences, and uh, see how it balances after that. So. Hang on just a minute and we'll get uh, we'll get that set up. Okay, we're back. Uh, I took the bar off of the uh, of that saw and uh, this organ bar, just so you know, has actually been a pretty good bar. It uh, a light a little more light here maybe. I got about ten cords on the saw on this bar. It doesn't have any lip on it. Uh, I have had no problems with it. Oil, oil's good. The tip seems to be in good shape after about 10 or so uh, cords, maybe a little more. Uh, I'm sure of a little bit of paint off of it. It's been really good. So I, uh, I can't complain. I just thought I would have, uh, I would try a little bit lighter bar just. Um, because and these uh, Shigahara bars are supposed to be uh, last even longer and um, are supposed to be stronger. I've seen them bent really bad in trees sitting on them and then spring right back. So we'll see. They claim. Uh, look at their look at their uh, specs. Uh, it's a resin filled bar. Supposed to have flexibility without compromise. Uh, eliminates rail cracking and chipping, even even heat distribution from no blemish steel construction. So they don't really have a lot of paint on them. Uh, I think they just maybe have some clear. Uh, they claim uh, four times longer than a standard bar, so they are more expensive. They're not. If you find them on sale, they're not a lot more expensive. Uh, I believe I paid. I don't remember what I paid for this, but I did get it on sale at uh, HL Supply. So. You look for them on sale they're not a ton more than a regular bar all right so first thing i want to do is uh, weigh these bars and just just for an idea just get an idea of, of what they're like so let's look at this organ bar first i'm going to pull the the uh camera down here so you can see so this is what we're going to weigh it on today and here's the organ bar and that bar weighs three pounds 13 ounces all steel bar no inserts the shigahar bar weighs three pounds four and a half ounces so you know not a ton of weight difference what's that eight and a half ounces something like that 
which might make a difference running all day on the uh, on the saw. So hopefully, sorry for moving you around. Uh, hopefully that'll help a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and mount this, get this mounted back on the chainsaw, and we'll see how it balances compared to when I had the other bar on. And if it stops raining, maybe we will run out and do a little cutting with it and see what it feels like. All right, we'll be back. Okay, guys, we're going to uh, just make a few cuts with this, uh, this new bar and see what it feels like. Uh, as far as balance goes, I think it's pretty close even though it's only about a half a pound difference. Although it does feel like the bar is riding higher at the top, at the front. So it, that would stand a reason. Uh, so that might help a little bit, be a little bit more neutral balanced. So let's throw some gloves on and make a couple cuts and see what it feels like. Well, I think overall, it does feel a little different. I didn't think it was, only a half a pound. Uh, but it does feel lighter in the front end. Running that thing all day, that heavy saw, it's heavy to me. Um, I think it's gonna make a difference. So it's probably worth the money, especially if it lasts longer, which it's supposed to. Uh, the lightness helps. And uh, yeah, it's a bar, it cuts. Uh, that was uh, eucalyptus. A eucalyptus log probably about 10 11 inches not real big um, of course that was the chain not the bar but yeah overall I think it's gonna be good we'll know a little bit more later if I uh, if I have any problems or if I see any real big differences I will update this this video and and get you guys some more information hopefully this helps somebody's decision on buying I looked for a long time I looked at the uh, looked at kind of all the bars and uh, I ended up with the Shigahara. Uh, waited till it went on sale because you kind of do that. Um, so yeah, we'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching.